everyone, so today I want to show you how to make a really cool DIY cloud light. Credits is to Tiffy Quick. You should definitely subscribe to her channel because she makes awesome DIYs and her channel is just overall amazing. So for ingredients, you're gonna need pillow stuffing. I just got mine off of Amazon. You also need a hot glue gun, paper lantern, and fairy lights or lights, any lights of your choice. I don't prefer Christmas lights because they can get hot really easily and extra glue sticks. So to start off, you want to assemble your paper lantern. So when you have your paper lantern, it comes with the paper lantern and the expander. And what I'm showing you here is the bottom of the expander, and that goes in the bottom. And then I'm showing you the two little circle hooks that are on the paper lantern. That is the top of the lantern. So you go ahead and insert your expander into the paper lantern. And then once it's all the way in, you want to like bend it a little to hook it, hook the legs to the circles and go ahead and adjust it as you insert it. And then there it is, your paper lantern. So to make the cloud light, take your pillow stuffing and grab your glue gun and just put some glue onto the paper lantern and then put your pillow stuffing on it. And you just want to do it throughout all of the entire paper lantern and make sure you don't cover the top and the bottom because that's where you're going to put your lights. So I'm just continuing to add more pillow stuffing to the paper lantern. So this is the finished product and this is what it looks like after it is done. It looks amazing. So what you want to do next is go ahead and put your lights into the paper liner and I'm going to show you how to do that. I already put out, put batteries in mine so I'm just pretending like I'm opening the box again even though I already opened it but yeah. untangle your lights and I'm just rolling it into a circle so that it'll be more organized and then I went ahead and inserted the control into the top of the paper lantern and then I'm looping it through until it comes out the other end like this and then I went ahead and put my lights into it you want to be really careful with this And then once it's in, you can go ahead and turn on your lights. And this is what it looks like. It looks really beautiful. So I actually made this a long time ago. And you can also do the same. You can make more clouds and create a group of clouds to make it more realistic and tie it on a dowel and string so that's what i did so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this comment like and subscribe All right.